Congratulations on purchasing your grand byline cold storage cabinet. Maintenance and prevention measures are essential to the longevity of your unit. Please ensure the following when installing your grand refrigerator or freezer. Ensure that the cabinet is installed indoors in a sufficiently dry, non-corrosive and ventilated environment, out of direct contact with sunlight or other heat sources. Ensure that a protective film on the cabinet is removed and that the cabinet is sufficiently cleaned. The cabinet must stand upright for a period of 24 hours if it has been placed on its side to ensure that the gas settles in the system. Your cabinet must be placed on a sufficiently leveled surface and if the cabinet is equipped with wheels or casters, make sure that they are locked once in position. If your cabinet is equipped with a combination of drawers and a glass door, ensure that a tilt bracket is mounted. For a laboratory with multiple units, it is important that they are spaced at least 30 millimeters apart and 75 millimeters from the back wall and that there is nothing covering or obstructing the top of the cabinet. This is applicable to units where the compressor is positioned on top of the unit. It is also important to ensure that the holes in the front of the cabinet are not covered. No matter what samples are stored in the cabinet, it is important that no electrical appliances are being used inside of the cabinet while it is functioning. On connection of the unit to the main electrical source, ensure that the correct electrical connection is used. You can refer to the number plate on the unit to compare the local electrical values with the unit's required electrical values. Once plugged in, ensure that the electrical cabinet is secured in the terminal box with hanger. Be sure to mark the electrical cord width. Do not separate when energized. To ensure correct functionality and efficiency of the cold storage cabinet, make sure that no products are stored on the floor inside of the unit. Products should only be stored on the shelves to ensure efficient and effective airflow inside the unit. This will ensure uniformity of temperature throughout the inside of the cabinet and therefore better storage potential. It is important to limit door opening to a minimum and ensure that the door is always closed properly in order to maintain the cabinet's internal temperature. Lastly, the condenser must be kept clean and dust free so that air can pass through the condenser unobstructed.